Elon Musk gives a sneak peek of his latest project. It's an underground tunnel system that could relieve traffic in Los Angeles. Musk showed that preview on Instagram. It's not clear exactly where the tunnel shown in the video is located. Reports say that Musk's system would have vehicles moving through underground tunnels on car-sized platforms, but it hasn't been tested yet. That tunnel would run almost three miles under West LA. Now we want to check in with 13 First Alert Chief Meteorologist. Carla Welga, or actually I, I, I promoted you, you because did, I didn't realize you. we hadn't changed our prompter there, but <laughs> you're, you're good enough to be cheap for a day. Thank you, Carla. <laughs> I appreciate that. And, uh, you know, temperatures, that's the other thing we have going on the cool down. And though it's not a huge difference from this time yesterday, uh, still enough to make a difference from just a couple days ago when we were at 105. Check out the numbers. McCarran, 91 degrees. Nellis Air Force Base, uh, just the same. A whole lot of 91. Centennial Hills uh, also there, 89 in Henderson. But the wind speeds is really what we're focused on. Uh, we're, we've seen gusts to about 40 miles per hour this afternoon. These are sustained wind speeds, 31 Nellis Air Force Base. Uh, and as we move through the rest of the evening, the numbers continue high. We're going to continue to see sustained wind speeds between about 15 and 25 miles per hour. There's the 11 o'clock hour. This is the time that wind advisory expires. So after this, I really think we're going to see a decrease in the wind speeds. And by morning, they look a lot calmer. And notice a little bit of a shift in the direction throughout the day. There's lunchtime and you see some breeze is coming back into the valley in the afternoon. Uh, 11 mile per hour winds in Las Vegas, Henderson at 13. And then as we head into the the afternoon they stay sort of steady in the breezy category and then they diminish as we head into the evening hours. So Saturday, Sunday look much better as far uh, as wind speeds are concerned. Gusts are about 25 both Saturday and Sunday, so that puts us uh, well into the breezy category, not windy like we are today. Monday, Tuesday, the occasional breeze is a system that is bringing us uh, the windy conditions lingers over the area, but it just loses a lot of its energy. Luckily, this is going to bring uh, pollen levels down. Check it out 4.9 by Sunday and we continue uh, on the lower end, certainly lower than we've seen uh, in weeks past. So overnight 65 degrees, pretty mild temperatures. If you're headed out for tonight, yes, you're going to have uh, the nuisance wind, but temperatures will be quite nice. 61 degrees in Anthem, uh, 63 Boulder City in North Las Vegas coming in at 64. Temperatures for tomorrow below average for this time of year. Hard to believe we're saying that after such heat earlier this week. 81 Sunrise Manor, 83 Henderson and North Las Vegas coming in at 82 degrees. There's your 13 first alert seven day plan. Mother's Day looking lovely. Yes, it will be a little bit breezy, but take a look at this temperature. A picture perfect 85 degrees. Anything you're planning outside, do take the breezes into account, uh, but it'll be very, very nice. We'll start to warm up as a system. As I said, it's going to lose a lot of its energy. So by Tuesday, we'll be back at the 90 degree mark. Then we have another system that's going to roll in again, picking up the breezes on Wednesday. We'll start to try to warm up, but then that will bring another little cool down by the end of the week. More cloud cover and windy conditions on Thursday and Friday. Carla. All right, thank you, Carla.